All right, here we go for part two of this video. I'm ready now. Um, I did make a mistake here and I want to share that with you so you don't do the same thing. You really want to notice after you've drawn, cut out your shapes and notice I place them back to where they go so I can just kind of see the whole picture together. And it helps me to understand what I'm going to glue on this side and what's going to stay here. So I'm going to glue all of my small pieces onto this side first not my flipped pieces. If you wanted to get a little more complicated with these little pieces that I've cut out from that main shape, you're gonna wait on those. Those are gonna stay glued on this page. But all of these pieces that I cut out, like this one earlier that you saw me do, I'm gonna glue and make sure I flip this page and glue those into place. So I want you to see me do that because I made the mistake earlier, like you might, of taking this big piece in the middle and gluing it not what I wanted, I realized that right away. So learn from my mistakes of not having done this in a while. So the piece I cut out here, I know that's gonna get flipped over here. So while they're in place, I'm gluing. Matter of fact, I'm just gonna glue here and I'm gonna glue a little better later after I'm done. So I can get things just kind of where I wanna go. I'm gonna remove this. Now, if you wanna just flip that because you can kind of estimate where it's going to go and just give it that flip right here and notice I'm just making sure see this little corner here making sure that's lining up now there's glue on the back side of this so I want to be careful and get that down in place and just use my clean fingers to push that into place okay just like that all right I'm not going to glue this down yet right I just want to see that they line up here now this piece Right, I'm gonna set that there. And that's gonna do the flip, that double flip I was talking about. You could even do a little triple flip if you wanted to cut this out and it goes opposite here, mirror image. But I'm not gonna do that here. Let's keep it, let's keep it here. So I'm gonna cut and glue, I've already cut. I'm gonna glue and then flip this one this way. And again, you're gonna make sure, see there's the, the middle line where I fold my paper gonna make sure that these line up right there pretty well. Okay, there's that. And I'm gonna do that with the rest of these big pieces I've cut out from the edge. It works out so much better when you cut from the edge and not from the middle. That just gets complicated. If some of you are ready for that, you can do that on your own, that's wonderful. But I'm gonna just show you the basics here. So this, as you can see, if you're not sure where this is gonna end up, here's what I would do. Again, I know this is gonna to wanna to go on the other side. I'm gonna glue, 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 glue. And I'm gonna let the flip glue, the flip help me out. Meaning when I flip this page over, it's gonna help me understand where that's gonna get glued. So I'm going to flip it over really gently, matter of fact. And then when I pull this open, I can see it's right here, but oh, it's not perfect. So I'm gonna, since I barely pushed down on it, I'm gonna give this a little help and make sure this is lined up on the edge, just like that. Ah, better, better, better. Now, I bet you can guess where these go. They're gonna go right back where they were. They're right in that same place, matter of fact. So you could kind of eyeball this and just flip that over, set that right in the middle. Again, look at the edge here, right up against the edge. Be paying close attention to that. It can really throw it off if you glue that and you're just not really careful like that, okay? And make sure this is somewhat in place so you can sense or see where that goes. Okay, just like that. Now I've got my other pieces to do the same thing with, right? This is gonna go over here. Again, I'm gonna set it back in place. Make sure my puzzle is kind of put back together. I'm gonna to push that out of the way and then do my gluing. Okay, I'm gonna move this out of the way. Fold the cover onto itself very gently. Gently, because I know I'm gonna to need to adjust. Open it back up again. And then I can see I need a little adjustment. This is kind of very careful work. Oh, that didn't work out too well. Let me, I'm gonna pull that down just a bit. 
Okay, that feels a little bit better. There we go. They do take a little adjustment, that's okay. Okay, here we go, we're almost done. That's gonna go there. Oh, I can see the vision, I see the final vision. All right, so I'm gonna glue this down, so I need to flip that over, glue that. There we go, now it's like that. Let's make sure I have it in the right place. There we go, find the edge. That one just needs glued down. And this big piece, now we're ready to glue that down right where it is. So I'm gonna flip that over. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna move this out of the way because I know we don't wanna get that all gluey. Big piece in the middle is the trickiest part of it all. Take your time. See how I'm taking time to bring it to the edge and line that up. And I'm being very gentle first in case I need to adjust. And then something I like to do is close the whole folder in half and give it another really good, maybe even fold that another good rub here. Cool, all right, final design, voila, there we go. Beautiful. No ton. All right. Good job, guys.